Hi guys, my name is Steph and I am a London based photographer who is answering questions that people have asked me about photography. I hope it helps. If I don't, thanks for watching. But anyway, into the video. How to deal with not being able to make your vision reality because of a lack of resources? Just think outside the box and using what you do have and creating something with that. For example, if you can't use a studio or you can't afford one, then you know find a space which is just like a, a plain blank wall or whatever and then you can literally stick on a background on it and then boom, you got it. You got a studio. Where do you shoot your photos which have a background really want to try that setting? I shoot at a studio in Deptford called Studio in One. They have like over 10 clothes which is amazing. Like it's a virtual dream. And they also do 10% off for students, so check them out. Do you shoot film? If so, which kind? I shoot with Fujifilm C200. In the past, I've used Fujifilm C200 Disposable and Kodak Color Plus. And I also shoot with the Olympus Muji 2, I think. I'll have to double check that, like, insert pictures on my bot. Yeah. How long did it take you to create your design and will the second issue take the same time? It took me a few months to complete, like to like finish up design just because I was doing my A-levels by making designs. I passed them both thankfully, but it was just a really stressful like moment in my life where I happened to do my art coursework, do my PE coursework, and then do the black girl design and then do the fan bit design. It was a lot. What we got there. Um, future issues will take slightly less time just because I'm taking a gap year, so yeah. How many issues of your design would there be, or is it continuous? With a black design, it may just be one, I'm not too sure what happens in the future. What happens? I what with fun bits, there will be more. I've already got quite a few ideas for it, so yeah, that will be like four times a year, probably less. Mm. I don't know, but I'm taking a gap, so who knows. Who did you use to print your designs? I used a company called Microgress to print both my designs, Black Girl and Fendits. What do you use to edit I love your shops? Thank you. And I use Lightroom and Photoshop to edit my work. What motivates you, the end result of a shoot or the reaction of other people? So I think it's more the end result that motivates me more just because you know, like the the entire process of like setting a shoe top, like the administration, getting the shoe ready, getting the colours, the the concept, the accessories, just everything that goes into putting that concept into a real life is long, tiring, and then you got the aftermath, which is the editing, even longer. But the end result is definitely probably like the best. And like the like reaction from people like it's just a plus for me to win this. So, yeah. How do you get all these sick locations? Teach me a way, you thanks. But I I don't really do like locations, so I don't really know. I think it's more because of the concept and the angle and just like basically it's just the way I take the photo and the way I edit it is what makes it an amazing photo. And I think that's how I guess. I think honestly, getting the perfect location is just how you use that location. That was really deep. I'm so deep. Best way to start the design up on a website. A website, literally your own website could be for photography, like a portfolio of like styling, literally whatever. Yeah. Um, best way to start design off. Um, that's really up to you, literally, just, it's just an idea that you want to pr continue progressing and progressing, basically. And I do love them, kind of like, never really get bored of. How did you make designs as it's something I'd love to do one day? Um, I made them using InDesign. Tip, 
Adobe, they have Adobe Creative Cloud and if you're a student you can get like 50% off whatever for like to use the Premiere Pro and Lightroom, Photoshop, After Effects, Gucci basically. I think mean, like, everything Adobe has, like sixteen pound forty four a month and I did that and it's amazing now they like added the price of Adobe, so it's like what, twenty five quid a month. Oh, it's okay. How would you describe your photography style? I feel just bold really. Um I'm just colourful. That's like my style. Plus I love shooting with colours. <gasps> I shot with green the other day, not the other day, like a few weeks back. Mate, I was in love, like, ugh, I've never shot with green before, and then I shot with that green, I was just like, I love it, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs>